Bling. So, hi, at 3D Dream Studio. I see your question in the Octane forum, in the Otai forum for the Octane plugin uh, from Lightwave. And you cannot uh, create a transparency etched on an object. And you see here, you node set up and you put in the opacity channel your Octane Dirt node. And then you say you see not a transparency channel. And that have a simple reason. And the reason is that the dirt node is a contact node. And I show you now the way you can see your transparency. You have here your plane. And you see here uh, this ball, yes. And if I move now the ball under the plane, you see what the dirt node really do. Yeah? The dirt node is a contact node and the dirt node can only work if you have contact to another geometry to read out the radius in the area he works at the, the transparency. Yeah? And if you drop the dirt node in your opacity channel here, that's, uh, uh, that's then the, um, the final, yeah? if you do it in that way. You have then in that area, your contact geometry become a transparency uh, edge, yeah? or a transparency area. Yeah? You see it, if I move the ball under, the, under your plane, you, you uh, give me, you can see, yeah? what is do. So now we play a little bit with the dirt node. If I open the dirt node here and play now with the parameter, you can do with the radius here for the following. If I go with the radius to 1 here, you see the radius would greater or make the radius to 0. Yeah, This effect is, is off. And it means you have more, more than one parameter you have to uh, to edit in that case for your edge transparency and it will only work if you have a second geometry to show your your dirt node that in that area you have to show uh, a transparency yeah in this case here is that ball and that's a simple setup in that area you uh, would see the transparency here uh, with your setup, you see only it as as uh, alpha mask, yeah. It's then an alpha, but you can only build a little more complex setups like this this part here on top. And if I drop it here in that as a material to your plane, you see I can do the same, but with mixed materials, for example, with the glossy material and the specular material, and I can also say okay show me the transparency area in that way you see it so you can not only drop the the transparency range you can also say okay in the transparency area i would have a different color else okay so you have only one to do in your scene uh, put in your scene a second object Put it under your plane and play then, uh, play then with your uh, with your dirt uh, node radius here with that radius, and you would see in what way it works. Yeah, it's, it's a really a really nice feature, and you can also play with the tolerance here. It have have also uh, some. That make only some ch uh, uh, also some changes, yes. So and you can see it here. You your node setup work in the same way as my. If you do it in that way here, yeah. And if you change the radius, it's not so it's it's not so wide, and you make the radius higher. It's higher, yeah. But the node would only work if you have a second geometry you can cast the area for the transparency yeah the, 
And the reason is that the dirt node is a contact node there. Yeah? So I hope you understand uh, the principle now from the, from the dirt node and in what way it works. Uh, have fun eh? with the rendering. <laughs> Later, bye bye.